Hi, welcome to Coastal Update, presented to you by the brokers and agents at Remax of Gulf Shores. This is our 10-month condominium report for the area we call Pleasure Island, consisting of Gulf Shores, Orange Beach, Fort Morgan, and Perdido Key in Florida. We've gathered all the data from the Baldwin County Association of Realtors database. So let's take a look at the market. This chart represents inventory of the number of condominiums that show as active on the market. And on November 1st, there were 762, substantially less than the 943 we saw a year ago. So inventory is definitely shrinking. This chart shows condominium sales on a month-by-month -month basis over the last two years, with 103 condominiums changing hands in the month of October. And while you see that's a little bit above last October, even though you see that downward trend over the last several months. Here are the first 10 months of 16 versus the first 10 months of 2015. Units sold virtually identical. The average sales price up about 3% to $322,000. And the median price, meaning half the sales were above and half the sales were below that number, was up 4% to $286,500. Then we look at the average dollars per square foot to get a barometer of value across all price ranges. And it was up 5.5% to nearly $250 a square foot. Then we measure demand by looking at how many units show as pending or with a first right of refusal. That's up a whopping 37% to 302 units. That's how we expect to close out the year strongly. These units should close in the next 30 to 60 days. If you're thinking about buying or selling here along the beautiful Alabama Gulf Coast, contact your local market experts, the Norwood team at Remax of Gulf Shores, so they can help you with that important decision. They make it their job to stay on top of the market so you can make the most informed decision possible. We hope you found this video informative and we look forward to hearing from you soon. Tune in next month for another Coastal Update. Thanks for watching and have a great day.